Germany's appearance in a major tournament is pretty much a given these days. The 1968 European Championship was the last one they missed. Top of Group C in European World Cup qualifying, Joachim Löw took his team to Kazakhstan on Friday and they were ahead inside 20 minutes on an artificial pitch. Bastian Schweinsteiger's shot going in by the chest of Thomas Muller. One quickly became two, Mario Goetze capitalising on some poor defending to put Germany firmly in the driving seat in Astana. Mesut Ozil set up Muller for a third after half-time as Germany eased to a 3-0 win. The victory kept Germany well on course to top Group C and advance to the finals. Sweden, Austria and the Republic of Ireland look set to battle it out for second place. In Group F, Portugal were keen to end a run of four international games without a win on their trip to Israel, in danger of falling behind group leaders Russia. Bruno Alves headed in an early corner and Paolo Bento's team appeared on course. But the away side failed to build on that and Mallorca's Tomé Hemed had the Tel Aviv crowd in raptures when he swivelled to volley in a superb equaliser. With six goals, Hammers the leading scorer in European World Cup qualifying. And five minutes before the break, then Bessat broke clear to smash in a second for Israel. With Cristiano Ronaldo ineffective, Portugal were left scratching their heads again when, with 20 minutes left, Celtic's Rami Gershon made it 3 1. That seemed to spark Portugal and Ronaldo into life. The Real Madrid ace setting up Helder Postiga to reduce the arrears two minutes later. That set up a grandstand finish and sure enough Portugal managed to find an equaliser. In the third minute of added time Fabio Contral's close range finish made it 3-3 and the points were shared. The draw leaving Israel and Portugal trailing in Russia's wake in Group F. Leaders Russia saw their game in Northern Ireland postponed due to bad weather. No wins from three qualifiers had put Denmark's World Cup ambitions in jeopardy ahead of their trip to play the Czech Republic in Group B. Following a goalless first half, Andreas Cornelius put the Danes ahead in Olomouc. The 20-year-old capitalising on some poor defending to score his fifth international goal. The FC Copenhagen striker has had an impact for his national side, scoring a hat-trick against Canada in January. And Denmark doubled their lead shortly after the hour. Simon Kjær heading home a Christian Eriksen corner to make it 2-0. Nicky Zimling added a third for the visitors late on. A 3-0 win greatly improving Denmark's hopes of making Brazil 2014. They join the Czechs on five points in Group B. Four behind second place Bulgaria who thrashed Malta and five behind leaders Italy.